Listen guys, and girls, especially girls actually, I'm trash at texting, okay? Like, and I don't mean like I text slowly, like I mean I kind of do, but I just mean like I'm genuinely horrible at communicating via text. And it sucks, cause you know, in this day and age, that's how we communicate. Like texting is like your second personality, you know? It's an entirely separate source of communication compared to actually talking. And my thoughts and verbalization of these thoughts often don't really translate well to text. Sometimes you can't even understand what I'm saying at all. That aside, often the delivery of how I want a text to come across just isn't there. Like when a girl texts me, hey, sorry for not responding to you the whole day, and you know, that happens a lot. And you know, I reply, I accept your apology, but the damage is done. That doesn't really read well over text, you know, just, just kind of weird. But like, if I read that out loud, hey, sorry for not responding to you the whole day, ha, I accept your apology, but the damage is done. Nah, I'm just, I'm just messing around. Yeah, I'm just, how are you though? You good? Yeah, I'm good. How are you? I am not good. I'm dying on the inside. Oh. Yeah, I mean, it's still pretty weird, but <laughs> I can't see. Basically, how the fuck are my jokes supposed to land over text? They're not going to, okay? They're, oh man. Now, this isn't really an issue with people that I already know. It's when I don't really know someone that this is a problem. So this mainly applies to dating. Dating. Why is dating always facilitated over text? Why? Why can't we call? All right, why do I have to wait until I pass the freaking texting etiquette threshold or whatever? By texting etiquette threshold, I mean, I mean, I just made this phrase up, but I'm referring to the set of texting rules you have to follow in conjunction with an arbitrary threshold of text volume that two people have to exchange before they can move on to communication beyond texting. So I overcomplicated the fuck out of that definition, but basically that just means two people have to text each other back and forth for a while before they can call. And so getting to this point is ass, cause I already fucked it up by then. <laughs> but if calling people was the norm, I would be a player. Well, no, I mean, I wouldn't be a player, but I would be in player contention, maybe. But my personality just completely changes over text. You know, I'm no longer fun or quirky or, you know, basically anything positive. I'm just weird. And that's not not true. Like I am weird, but you know, I have other qualities. Just ask, you know, you need to follow the freaking like proper texting etiquette so that people don't think you're freaking weird. It doesn't work. I'm still weird. God forbid you send a text. That's not fucking basic as shit. And if you ask to call someone too soon, like before you reach the texting etiquette threshold, they're freaking weirded out. It's like I fucking offended them. The fuck did you just say? You want to call? Who the fuck do you think you are? You think you've earned that right? You haven't. Not even close, bitch. Like, you can just hang up. Like, it's not a big commitment, you know? Like, we don't have to talk for that long. Like, in fact, calling is way more efficient. Objectively, there's just so much more content that you can fit into a phone conversation. Like, a five minute phone call can translate into like an hour long text conversation. And even still, like, you ever have a text conversation that is really flowing? It's stressful. Like, when you're typing as fast as you can to respond to the first part of someone's text message, but then there's still two other parts that you're responding to, so you type out those parts, but then they reply to the first part that you already sent, so then you just abandon the other two things you were talking about. Like, you already had a full paragraph right, and you just delete that full paragraph because it isn't relevant to what you're talking about right now. Ah, <sighs> it's a lot going on, man. It's like freaking chess, which I play for all the girls watching. And plus, isn't calling just gonna be a more accurate representation of what someone's like as a person? You don't actually text. When you see someone in person, you're not gonna text them. You're gonna fucking, hey, how's it going, bro? You're not gonna be like, oh shit, dude. Hey, yo, look to your right, bro. Oh, it's me. I'm not actually gonna talk to you. I'm just gonna keep texting you from five meters away. I don't know why I use meters metric system when I'm American, but. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't write that part down. I just now I know this borders on being completely subjective, but like aren't phone calls just more fun, right? Enjoyable. Let's be real. How often are you actually laughing over text? Unless someone types LMFAO all caps with like two crying laughing emojis, then yeah, they probably laughed. But otherwise, nah. But phone calls, straight banter. If we're chatting on the phone, all right, we're gonna be laughing. All right, there's gonna be some serious banter going down. And even if you're not laughing, I'll probably be laughing and then that'll make you laugh and then we're all good, you know? I don't even have to be funny, I can just laugh. Ha ha! Ha! Like you can't vibe over text, all right? You can't. Phone calls just flow, you know, they're disarming. People probably say stuff like, oh, there's fun stuff to do over text, like you can play pool or, all right, no, fuck that. I'm not playing pool over iMessage. See me at the table, all right, Patrick Ruvo. Bitch. Okay, listen, I don't want to bash texting too much. Like, obviously, texting has its uses. Like, it's convenient, you know, if you're like sending someone like a list or like, you know, like a reminder or, you know, whatever. You know, obviously, texting has its uses. But let's not just chat over text, you know? Come on. Not to sound like a boomer or anything, but isn't genuine human connection just better? Like, in general, right? Why do we love texting so much, right? Let's cancel texting for my sake, because I'm selfish. And yeah, I think that's about it. 
Um, so yeah, if you guys couldn't tell, I'm fucking single. Uh, if you're one of my friends that isn't single, uh, fuck you, Carson. It's a really fantastic photo of Carson though. You know, like looks magical as fuck. Uh, to the girl that I'm kind of texting with now, I uh, hope you don't see this, but I thought of this video before we started texting, okay? So, nothing personal, kid. Wow, it's pretty freaking cringe. All right, I don't care though. Sorry I haven't uploaded the past few months. I, was, I got pretty busy at school and I don't know. I got a little burnt out. Like I didn't want to make videos just for the sake of making videos. Like I want to make better videos than what I was previously making. You know what I mean? I think quality over quantity, you know? This next, this next video, it's a trip. That's basically about it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking with me. Uh, I'll promise to bring you guys some awesome content going forward. And yeah, thanks for watching.